won't want to miss this solar eclipse. It won't happen again in the U.S. until 2024. That's why one person making sure he will be in perfect position for the celestial event. Meteorologist Dirk Verdorn, you are planning a special vacation for this eclipse. You've been planning this for a while. Yeah, I, I submitted this last year, uh, knowing that the eclipse was coming to make sure that I was able to get the time off to uh, go and, and, and see this uh, event because this is going to be spectacular and uh, to see a total eclipse. I've seen plenty of eclipses, but to actually see a total eclipse, I haven't done it. So this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. So this is going to be August 21st, like I said, a month away from uh, today. It's going to be traveling from Salem, Oregon, all the way to Columbia, South Carolina. Now that's where the total eclipse is going to be, but a lot of people are going to be able to share in this because it's going to cover a huge area. We're looking at 90% of the sun that you'll be able to see covered in through Northern California. So up near Shasta, those areas will see that. As you make your way more towards Sacramento, we're looking at about 80% of the sun being covered. That's a lot of the sun, so it's gonna, you're going to notice it's going to get darker, and if you have your special glasses, you're going to be able to see that. If you don't have the glasses, don't look at the sun. Would not recommend it. Also in Southern California, the sun will be 70% covered. So on August 21st, when is this going to happen? Well, it's going to reach its maximum, or at least that's when the shadow or the moon is going to uh, cover out the sun at its, its greatest there at 10, 17 a.m. So it's going to be a morning event, and then you can talk about it the rest of the day, but it's going to be a spectacular event so hopefully you'll be able to uh, take the time to enjoy that again the morning Monday morning August 21st at 7 or 10 17 that's what